Well, hi everybody. This week I'm talking about creating the healthiest life possible for yourself. And I just have to say, as I continue to age gracefully, as gracefully as I know how, it has become more and more important to me. And when something is important to me, I love sharing it with you all. So hopefully you've tuned into the latest Life You Want class. I invited Dr. Peter Atia, author of Outlive, The Science and Art of Longevity, to discuss some of his revolutionary ideas uh, that are shaking up our outdated approach to medicine and disease. He explains in Outlive that the key to longevity boils down to knowing the difference between lifespan and health span. I think that's interesting because you see health span, he says, is a period of time in which you are free from disability and disease. And to increase our quality of life and the duration of our health span, we have to shift the paradigm from treatment, treatment, treatment to prevention. And that involves focusing on certain factors in the vitality formula, he calls it, like exercise, nutrition, sleep, mental health, all the things we've heard before, but I'm telling you, matter as you get older. So Outlive is not just going to change your life, but it will enhance it for years to come. It's important that we prepare now in our present state, he says, for what's to come down the road so that you can enter the later stages of life uh, uh, as healthy as possible. You have more control than you think, no matter what age you are. Dr. Atia shares all the things that we should be doing now to make your later in life health a priority. So insiders, I'm asking you to think about this. What do you want your life to look like in your 90s? I've asked you that question before, um, but think about it for a moment and try to envision it. After I had both of my knees replaced, I vowed that I was gonna use my health to the greatest advantage, and I'm definitely gonna be putting Dr. Uh, Atiyah's principles in play. Apparently, he says grip strength is one of the keys to longevity. Uh, your ability to open bottles or open a jar or lift a baby, in my case, lifting my dogs. I'll be working on that for sure. And if you haven't watched the class yet, you can click the link below. Um, Dr. Tia said he sees people in their last decade of life realizing if they had just done a little bit more earlier in life, things would have been better. So let's start working to change that. I mean, you got to get moving and keep moving every day. I can't tell you what a difference it's made in my life. And we gotta leave the woulda, coulda, shouldas behind and lay the foundation for our healthiest, healthiest lifespan. Have a wonderful and healthful week, everybody. Go well.